I'm Seamus. Is this you? God, I hate trees. So was I. That's why I put two whole hours of research into finding a better one. Enter the Scotch Pine Tree. The best Christmas tree you'll ever gander at. Let's get into the nitty gritty, shall we? Because of the Scotch Pine's extremely hardy structure, they're amazing at adapting to environments they aren't quite used to. Adding on to this, their branches are way past sturdy, which means incredibly easy ornament placement. BAM! Scotch pine trees are generally known for their dark green foliage and sturdiness, but did you know that they're also the most common Christmas tree in Iowa? Now you do. To accentuate my point, let me throw it back over to live action Seamus. So I hired some people to show you just how good it is. Let's hear some glowing testimonials. Ever since I switched to the Scotch Pine, my divorce rate has been cut in half. Thanks, Scotch. This tree saved me and my entire family from a house fire and bought me a lifetime supply of refried beans. Thanks, Scotch Pine. I became a millionaire. Oh, I also found the cure for cancer. Oh, did I mention I got my dream? Who are you? Enough of them. Let's talk needles. Ah, uh, needles. Needles, needles, needles. The needles, or pines, on the scotch pine are no joke, as they're sharp and don't fall off when they're dry. In the industry, we call that a good needle retention. Clocking in at roughly 2-6 to six inches per pine, these babies are not going to be a hassle to clean once the holiday is over. Ah, that reminds me, the reasoning behind this commercial was to advertise why this tree made such a good Christmas tree. Remember how I said the branches were so good for hanging ornaments? This is where I was going with that. Anyway, say yes if you want more tree facts. According to this website I found- oh. Oh, must be a typo. Anyway, the tree that can grow 60 feet tall and 20 feet wide, it has a hundred variants in the wild, it grows two to three feet every year, it's an evergreen, it has orange bark, and it smells good. Really, what else is there to like? For frequently asked questions and common facts about the scotch pine tree, call the number depicted. If there's one thing I can take away from this experience, it's that I should definitely move to Iowa.